Hello, my name is Kim, professor of Kala Sagan University, India. Today is a fifth lecture of a DFT. DFT. Okay, and uh, the today uh, uh, topic is how to how to uh, handle the huge number of computations for uh, DFT. We call this FFT algorithm means fast Fourier uh, transform. Okay, let's see the DFT, DFT formula x of k is here. That is the function of k. And k, uh, of course, k is 0, 2, n minus 1, this is n numbers. Also, this uh, term is, is the, with, uh, the summation of, of uh, variable n like this. Okay, let's expand. Then x over 0 is uh, like this one, this one, into, into like this. This is, a, uh, let me suppose that this is uh, real, then this is a complex real, this is a complex number. Therefore, uh, th for this 1, 2, 3, and this n minus means, uh, we need uh, n times complex multiplications uh, for getting x over 0. And also, uh, for getting x over 1, we need also n times complex multiplications. And uh, this is the n in numbers of x of n, like this also, we need n times this one. Therefore, uh, n times of, this is n numbers, and x over k also we need uh, n numbers of computations here. They are totally, uh, we need n square uh, complex multiplications for calculation the TFT. And this is a very huge number of the uh, of the calculation, especially this is the complex number. Oh, the, the complex number, okay, it will take a so long time. Then, how to calculate effectively? Okay, for this 1965, Cooley and the Turk, uh, Cooley and the Turk, he was developed the algorithm of fast Fourier uh, transform. Then from now, let me explain what is the uh, fast Fourier transform FFT. Okay, this is the TFT uh, formula x of k is here. Uh, now, for simplicity, uh, this term we can uh, replace by this one. So that this one, n equal this one. Okay, now n equal 8. I expand all things. x of 0 equal x of 0 into double 0. Okay. This is k equal 0, the k equal 0, all 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, okay? And x of 1, k equal 1 is here, 0, 1, x, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And also x, x 2 of 2, we need uh, 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, like this. Uh, finally, x of 7, for this we need x of 0, 7, uh, 14, 21, 28, 35, 44, for like this. Like, like this, you can see here, uh, for calculating this, 8 point of x of k, 8 point of 8 point DFT, we need uh, 40, that the 50 kind of uh, this uh, uh, W functions. Okay. Then uh, let's see the, uh, this. What is the property of this one? Now, okay. Let in, in this case uh, n equal a. Then the w one. Uh, this a. The one zero equal or this this point. And the one, two is this point. Uh, this point uh, three. This point uh, four. This point uh, five. This point uh, six. This point uh, seven. A is also this one. A nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 15, 16, 17, 18 like this. Then you can see here, then, then, then you can see here, uh, for example from this, W8 means N, therefore this is K, K equal WN9 means K plus N. Also is WN uh, K plus 2N, like this. 
Therefore, we call this uh, uh, periodicity property. Periodicity property. Period property. And also, you can see uh, this value. This value is uh, minus. Uh, this value is minus this value. This one, this minus, minus this is uh, symmetry with respect to the, this origin. Therefore, W5 is minus W1. And W6 is minus W2. And uh, this value, W7 is, this is uh, minus W3, like this. Therefore, uh, for this, we, such that we, what we need is this one, four, uh, four, uh, four numbers of this W value, then we can calculate uh, all things by using the uh, symmetry and the periodic properties. And also, now you can see here, uh, let me, uh, let's take uh, some example for calculating x over 3 is uh, w0, uh, 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 16, 21 we need. For calculating this, uh, we use uh, this one, remove, okay, we need this one uh, from this. Okay, now w0 is here, this value, this value we need. W3 is uh, now here we can use uh, this value. W6, W6 is okay now is W6 is minus this means minus W82. Okay. And the W9, 9 is now okay, where the, okay, 9 is okay now this is 9. 9 means W1. This is W1. And the uh, W uh, 12, okay, 12 is very 12, 12 is W 4, this is a W, uh, W, uh, this means, what is uh, this value, minus, uh, minus W 0, okay, and the 15 is, this one means, uh, minus uh, W 3, 18 is, uh, this value is, uh, W, 2, 21, okay, 21 is now here, minus W, one like this. Therefore, for this, that so we have uh, this one, this one, this one, then we can use all things, okay, by using the uh, symmetry and the periodicity uh, properties of uh, uh, this one. One more thing. Uh, now here, uh, I would like to introduce divide, divide and the conquer clause. For this, we need n, the sample number of n, and uh, equals to 2 power of p. We call this a radix, 2 FF algorithm. This means n samples here, we divide n by 2, n by 2, okay? And also, n by 2, we can divide n by 4, n by 4. This n by 2 is divided by 2, n by 4, n by 4. And continue this process to uh, 2 point uh, TFT like this. For example, uh, this one. Now, this is x over 0 uh, to x over 7 also. Now, you can see uh, the order is uh, some the sorted. Uh, Missed order. Okay, let me, uh, for this, let me skip. Just let me let's see the how to calculate x over, uh, this is x over k. For example, k equal 1 is this one. This uh, calculated by, now here you can see, uh, go to here, can use uh, x over 4 and uh, can use x over 0, 0. And uh, uh, this will go to here, go to here, and we need uh, x over 6 and x over 2 and uh, now go to here this go to this place this is 5 and 1 and also go to here go to here go to here and go to the we need x of 7 and go to x of 3 like this like this x1 uh, can be calculated by using this flow and uh, exponential function just a w0 1 2, 3 is enough. No need of 5, 6, 7 like that. Because uh, this is the, has the some properties of symmetry and uh, periodicities. 
Okay, then uh, let's uh, compare the computational complexity for TFT and FFT. Now this is the, uh, in case of a TFT, like this you can see here, the order of n square, uh, in this case FFT, uh, by using the sym symmetry, property of symmetry and uh, periodicity properties, and uh, divide and concur. And uh, the multiplication is like this one. For example, n equal 1024 points, then in case of TFT, we need uh, uh, this amount of uh, complex uh, calculation, calculation numbers we need. But in case of FT, just we need uh, 5,120, 0.5%. Like this, the larger size of data N, the less computation times. Okay, therefore, this is very good uh, one. Uh, this is very, FFT is very good compared to this. That we have to know this one, we have to use just FFT, not di uh, direct DFT. By the way, uh, by the way, like uh, this, as I mentioned before, Cooley and uh, Turk, uh, was developed the first algorithm, this is FFT, FFT, 1965, okay, then let's, uh, let's check the uh, CPU speed, now 75 here, uh, 29 here, then this means almost, uh, it's almost uh, two times per three years. Okay, this is uh, two times per three years. Then, uh, 1965, now 220. That means uh, almost uh, 260,000 times as fast as the year 1965. Okay, not very, really. computer power is very high, very uh, rapidly, uh, pretty grown up like this one. This means uh, now uh, uh, we want to, we, we have to work some work, it will take one second. Then 1965 is a three days work. Okay, the the computer power is very, uh, very good. Therefore, now here, in, uh, in case of TFT, okay, uh, in case of TFT, 4096. Then for this, we can use, uh, okay, symmetry, periodicity, divide and conquer, we use, the left time is in case of CPU 3 gigahertz, uh, 0.40767. But also 4.97 point TFT. This means we cannot use symmetry, we cannot use periodicity, we cannot use the divide and conquer. But left time is just 3.5 times of this, 0 0.00. Okay, there are very short time you can do that. Therefore, therefore, we do not always need to take the number of TFT, this one, except uh, some special cases. That means uh, we can take any numbers, 400, uh, for 5,000. We can use any number of this one. But uh, we, if you want to uh, implement some hardware, it's better to use uh, these numbers. Okay, this is for uh, this is uh, the source for uh, your reference for uh, measuring the time. Now here, uh, in case of uh, port 96 case, tick, tock, and uh, from this, uh, port 97, yeah, tick and uh, tock. Then we can use the result like this one. Okay, thank you so much for your watching uh, today. How to calculate the large number of computations DFT was explained. This is uh, for uh, properties of uh, symmetry and the periodicity. And uh, divide and conquer approaches we did. This, uh, uh, okay. And also, uh, by using this, we can make the fast Fourier transform. Nowadays, then we have to use this one. Okay, sometimes no need this one. If you want to use arbitrary numbers of n, you can use it because of the very high speed of a concept computer. Therefore, finally, you can use any numbers, any numbers of data n. Okay. Thank you so much again.